most pilots feared anything that could punch holes into their aircraft. But for the P-51 Mustang, those openings under the belly didn't slow it down, they actually made it faster. At high speed, that big radiator scoop should have acted like a parachute. Instead, it created a surprising boost, pushing the Mustang forward with the force of hundreds of extra horsepower. What made this possible wasn't luck or a design accident. It was a brilliant bit of engineering that almost nobody believed at the time. Even the textbooks insisted that radiator ducts caused drag, and the Spitfire, using the same Merlin engine, hit a lower top speed despite having a cleaner-looking design. So how did the Mustang outrun almost everything in the sky? When engineers studied the airflow inside the P-51's cooling system, they realized something remarkable. Air rushed in through a wide opening, squeezed down through a narrow path, heated up from the engine, and then shot out the back like a jet nozzle. That blast of hot, compressed air produced real, measurable thrust. This phenomenon, later known as the Meredith effect, turned wasted engine heat into free forward power. That clever system didn't just give the Mustang extra speed. It played a huge role in the aircraft's incredible range, allowing P-51s to escort American bombers deep into Germany when no other fighter could make the trip. What most planes treated as a weakness, the Mustang transformed into one of its greatest strengths, a perfect example of how smart engineering can change the course of a war.